Hello and welcome back. In this short lecture, we're going to learn about how to configure and the importance of mobile device management authority in short MDM. So if you look at here in this screen, this is actually taken from uh, Microsoft Intune portal. Uh, as a first step, if you are uh, once you have signed up or once you have uh, done the high level of the configuration, in fact, if you want to work with anything related to the Intune, you need to in fact first set it as MDM authority so that means a supervising uh, you're uh, telling that you're uh, in tune that hey you now ready to manage your all the devices that's what the authority uh, which you need to configure as a first time so in fact here there are three different options you have the first one would be the Intune MDM authority as a radio button followed by configuration managed MDM authority now the configuration manager uh, MDM authority is by September month 8th or if I'm correct uh, it would be taken out so there would be only in tune MDM authority as uh, as of date as on date it should be you know used in fact because that is no more supported configuration manager MDM authority because uh, there is a hybrid configuration where uh, you used to do some kind of configuration within your system console as well as on uh, uh, on managing the mobile devices you need to take this second option which is configuration manager configuration manager MGM authority so in our case uh, we are not working anything related to the uh, configuration manager MDM authority in fact that has been already retired almost and nobody is using that and everybody is migrated from a uh, hybrid to Intune which is MDM authority now so we are gonna set that configuration to Microsoft Intune MDM authority in fact uh, there also there would be some kind of confusion for the people who are uh, coming from SEC background they don't know how or uh, if they don't know how to configure co-management in the co-management is one of other uh, feature set where on a same device you will have the two agents one is from into an agent other one would be the SSM client agent so uh, both the capabilities are uh, will be taken from uh, SCCM as well as the Intune so the agent agent or the end machine can be benefited by taking any of the benefits which are offered from Intune either uh, from SCCM uh, for that uh, you need to set it to only Intune uh, MDM authority which is a standalone authority in this case so if you uh, if you hear anything as Intune MDM authority or Intune standalone authority or co-management uh, configuration you need to choose the first radio button which is in this case this uh, Intune uh, MDM authority which we are going to configure now to configure mobile device management authority or MDM authority you need to go to Intune and from the Intune blade if you click on anywhere if you have not done uh, at any kind of you know configuration on the Intune it would directly take it to the uh, Intune authority to set it because that's the first step we need to configure. So I'm gonna take it as Intune MDM authority and choose. Uh, this might take some time to you know uh, configure in the background and uh, your Intune is now configured uh, in a way it to manage as a standalone authority. 